Shalom. Shalom. All right, I must say, this is uh, on the quieter side of the sanctuary um, with, with so many wonderful families here. So I'm going to do what is often ill-advised, but I'm going to invite you to turn around and wish Shabbat Shalom to people sitting next to you or behind you. And if you don't know them, you better find out their name and welcome them properly. And if there's no one sitting right next to you, why don't you walk over and say Shabbat Shalom? morning celebrating Shabbat. We are here this morning celebrating a special Shabbat, Shabbat HaChodesh. Uh, Rosh Chodesh Nisan begins on Tuesday, which means that we are approaching, we'll say, a special blessing later on today. We're approaching the month in which Passover happens, and so this is not just the Rosh Chodesh, and not just a month, it's the month. It also happens to be a first month in the Hebrew calendar. If you're confused, how can we have a Hebrew uh, a first month in the spring? And well, that's because the Torah says Rosh Hashanah is in the seventh month. So go figure. Uh, and we are welcoming this, preparing to welcome it, which means that it's a special Haftarah reading that our fifth graders have been working on. Our sixth graders have been working on the Torah chanting. Uh, it is a very, very special day indeed. 
We've spent a, an entire year working on this, um, so we're very, very proud of our students. I'm very excited to be here together. If you are, I hope you're holding a Mishkan Tefillah prayer book uh, in your hands. Please double check on the spine, it should say Shabbat and not weekdays and festivals, um, just in case. Um, I will be announcing pages. If you haven't used this book before, if you haven't used it enough, the most of the traditional service can be found on the right-hand side. Uh, and uh, on the left-hand side, you will often find alternative readings, commentaries, poetry, uh, additional things to feast your eyes and your soul on. Um, if I'm not announcing the page, um, then simply once whatever is on the right, once we finish, just turn the page over. And if you're completely lost, why don't you check in with your neighbor um, that you've just met, perhaps. Uh, we are going to enjoy this experience together this morning. Last but not least, I'm going to invite you to reach into your right pocket or your left pocket, wherever you carry your communication device and shut it down, uh, put it away. We will not need it to communicate with Eternal for the next couple of hours and everybody else can wait. And for those of you who are super excited and want to share this moment, powerful moment in the lives of your kids with those who perhaps could not be here with us in the sanctuary, we are, uh, we are streaming this to, to YouTube. The, the entire recording will be available. You will be able to share it um, as, as is with other services as well. So you don't, have to, uh, you don't have to worry about capturing moment, just be in the moment. How about that? Be in it fully, not through the screen of whatever device you're trying to use. Page 74. <laughs> sanctuary, not just the physical beauty, but also the beauty of the presence of the community in it. Uh, page 77, at the top, we join together. Blessed are you, Adonai, our God, sovereign of the universe. With divine wisdom, you have made our bodies, combining veins, arteries, and vital organs into a finely balanced network, wondrous maker and sustainer of life. Were one of them to fail, how well we are aware. We would lack the strength to stand before you. Blessed are you, Adonai, source of our health and strength. Baruch atah Adonai, rofe chol basar, umafli la'asot. We continue with the blessing for the soul, page 78. This one is a call and response. Elohai, neshamaha, shenatata, Oh, 
We continue with the morning blessings on page 80. Baruch Atah Adonai Eloheinu Melech HaOlam Who has given the mind the ability to distinguish day from night. Amen. Baruch Atah Adonai Eloheinu Melech HaOlam Who opens the eyes of the blind. Amen. Baruch Atah Adonai Eloheinu Melech HaOlam who free his the captive. Baruch atah Adonai, Eloheinu melech haolam, who lifts up the fallen. Baruch atah Adonai, Eloheinu melech haolam, who stretches the earth over the waters. Baruch atah Adonai, Eloheinu melech haolam, who strengthens our steps. Baruch atah Adonai, Eloheinu melech haolam, who clothes the naked. Baruch atah Adonai, Eloheinu melech haolam, who gives strength to the weary. Baruch atah Adonai, Eloheinu melech haolam, who removes sleep from the eyes, slumber from the eyelids. Baruch atah Adonai, Eloheinu melech haolam, who made me in the image of God. Baruch atah Adonai, Eloheinu melech haolam, who has made me free. Baruch atah Adonai, Eloheinu melech haolam, who has made me a Jew. Baruch atah Adonai, Eloheinu melech haolam, who girds Israel with strength. Baruch atah Adonai, Eloheinu melech haolam, who crowns Israel with splendor. <coughs> Baruch atah Adonai, Eloheinu melech haolam, asher kidashanu b'mitzvotav, v'tzivanu l'asog b'divrei Torah. O Adonai, our God, let the words of Torah be sweet in our mouths and the mouths of your people Israel, so that we, our descendants, and the descendants of all your people Israel may know you by studying your Torah for its own sake. Blessed are you, Adonai, who teaches Torah to your people Israel. Baruch atah Adonai, Hamilamed Torah le Amo Israel. In the middle of page 88, we study uh, one of the traditional passages from the Mishnah um, that, um, that reminds us of what are the values that we hold so dear. These are the things that are limitless, of which a person enjoys the fruit of the world while the principle remains in the world to come. They are honorings one father and mother engaging in deeds of compassion, arriving early for study, morning and evening, dealing graciously with guests, visiting the sick, providing for the wedding couple, accompanying the dead for burial, being devoted in prayer, and making peace among people. But the study of Torah encompasses them all. Uh, we continue now with, uh, with the part that is... Um, known as Psuke de Zimra, the Songs of Praise, page 100. We continue with the words of Psalm 150.
together in the middle of page 110. Praised are you, Adonai our God, sovereign of the universe, creator of light and darkness, who makes peace and fashions all things. In mercy you illumine the world and those who live upon it. In your goodness you daily renew creation. How numerous are your works, Adonai. In wisdom you formed them all, filling the earth with your creatures. We praise Adonai, our God, for the excellent work of your hands and for the lights you created. May they glorify you. Shine a new light upon Zion that we all may swiftly merit its radiance. Praise thy you, Adonai, creator of all heavenly lights. Baruch Ata Adonai, Yotzer Hameorot. Middle of page 112. How deeply you have loved us, Adonai, our God, gracing us with surpassing compassion. On account of our forebearers whose trust led you to teach them the laws of life, be gracious to us, teaching us as well. O merciful one, have mercy on us by making us able to understand and discern, to heed, learn, and teach, and lovingly to observe, perform, and fulfill all that is in your Torah. <laughs> Yeah. 
Adonai Elohecha Bechol levavcha Ubechol nafshecha Ubechol mildecha Vehayu Advarim Haele Asher anuchim Etzavecha Hayom Alevavecha Veshinantam Levanecha Vedivarta Baham Beshiftecha Bevetecha Ulechtecha Vadere Uveshobecha Uvekumecha Ukshartam Leot Al Yadecha Vehayul Totafod Beinecha Uktaftam Al Mezuzod Vetecha Uvisharecha Page 118 uh, you may be seated. Vayomer Adonai el Moshe lemor daber el bene Israel v'amarta aleihem v'asu lahem tzitzit al kanfei v'gedehem ledorotam v'natnu al tzitzit hakanav tilchelet v'haya lachem letzitzit Uritem oto, uschartem et kol mitzvot Adonai, vasitem otam, velota turu, acharei levavchem, vacharei neichem, asheratem zonim achareihem, leman tiskeru, vasitem et kol mitzvotai, vitem kedoshim leloichem. Ahani Adonai Eloheichem, Asher otzeiti etchem me'eretz Mitzrayim, Liot lachem l'Elohim, Ani Adonai Eloheichem, Adonai Eloheichem, Amen. From Egypt you redeemed us, freeing us from bondage. For that... Your beloved sang praise, exalting you. Your dear ones offered hymns, songs, praise, blessing, and thanksgiving to you as a sovereign and living and enduring God, high and exalted, great and awesome. God ever humbles the proud, raises the lowly, 
frees the imprisoned, redeems the afflicted, helps the oppressed, answering our people when we cry out, praise to God most high, blessed is God and deserving of blessing. In great joy, Moses, Miriam, and Israel responded with song to you, all of them proclaiming, page 122. <laughs> Adonai, 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 Adonai,
Sisters, please join me. Be pleased with our rest. Sanctify us with your mitzvot and grant us a share in your Torah. Satisfy us with your goodness and gladden us with your salvation. Purify our hearts to serve you in truth. In your gracious love, Adonai our God, grant us holy Shabbat as a heritage. May Israel, who sanctifies your name, rest on Shabbat. Baruch Ata Adonai, Mekadesh HaShabbat. Retse, Retse, Adonai Eloheinu, Beamcha Israel, Utefilatam, Beahava Tekabel, Utehil Razon Tamid, Utehil Razon Tamid, Avodahat Israel. Amecham Baruch Ata Adonai Amachazir Shechinato Shechinato Letzion Amachazir Shechinato Shechinato Letzion We turn out page 140 as we Conclude the Amidah with a blessing for peace. Sim Shalom.
Baruchata Adonai, Hamevarechet Amo Israel, Beshalom, Blessed are you Adonai, who praises your people Israel with peace. And we leave a few moments of silence at the end of Amidah for our private personal prayers to be offered at this time. Hose Shalom Bim Roma Uya Se Shalom Uya Se Shalom Aleinu Uya Se Shalom Aleinu Hose Shalom Bim Roma Shalom Shalom page 244 in our prayer book, uh, which means that we are about to start moving at a slightly different pace. Uh, we are approaching our Torah service. Um, so um, a, few, a few things that I need to say. Um, we are going to, um, part, part of today's experience is, of course, a Torah service um, and a Shabbat morning service. and. Many of, uh, of your families are already beginning to think uh, and imagine what the bar and bat mitzvah of your child will look like. This is pretty much what it will look like. Um, but of course, one main difference is that, and some of you are preparing for it very soon, you will know and will have assigned every mitzvah and every participatory role ahead of time. So both your guests or your family and you and I will know Today, this morning, some of you may be called on for various mitzvot in the service without warning. That's, uh, that's a very TE way for a regular service. So I'm going to try and navigate this. I'm very excited to see so many families. So we're going to try and see how we can involve everyone. So when I look at you and say, come and do this, you are going to joyfully run to the Vimar, right? Okay. 
I'm just, just, I'm just planting the ideas there. Um, the second thing is if you want to follow once we get to the Torah and Haftarah shortly, if you want to follow the reading and see the English translation of it, you can grab uh, a copy of a Chumash, a Torah in the back, uh, in the back of the room. And with that, I'm going to invite you all to rise, page 244. <clears throat> and I'm going to, we have lots and lots of grandparents uh, this morning, which is very exciting. So I'm going to invite some grandparents to come up and open the ark. So I see, I see one grandparent over here. Am I seeing... Um, others, there we go, okay, all right, coming up, come on, all right, 2.44. Ein kamocha va Elohim Adonai ve'ein kemaasecha malchutecha malchut kol olamim u'memshaltecha ve'kol dor v'ador Adonai melech Adonai malchut Adonai Mloch Leolam Vaheh Adonai Oz Leamo Iteh Adonai Yevaheh Et Amo Vashalom Avarat Amin Eitiva Verzom Cha Etzion Ivnei Homo Yerushalayim, siblings who are not in our fifth and sixth grade to come up and help us, follow us in the procession that will help to address the Torah. Okay. <laughs> Lecha Adonai Hamamlacha Veamit Nase Leko Leroj Rome Mu Adonai Eloheinu Veishtakavu Leha Arkocho Rome Mu Adonai Eloheinu Veishtakavu Kadosh 
Adonai Eloheinu Romemu Ki, ki, ki kadosh Adonai Eloheinu Romemu And we'll shake hands. There we go. Shakoa. No? Okay. Excellent. Now you can go back to your seats. Shakoa. And now you may be seated as well. All right. How's everyone doing? Wow, that's quiet. Okay. All right. So um, we are going to read today from the book of Leviticus, uh, this week's portion called Shmini. And um, you can find it, we'll start in, uh, with Leviticus chapter 10. We're starting with verse 13. And you can find it on page 447 in the Kumash if you want to follow. Um, and I am going to, we're going to do um, something. Uh, first of all, before we even begin, I have to tell you that uh, many years ago, we started, um, uh, we started trying to see if we can start teaching the skills of um, chanting from the Torah a little earlier before our students arrive in seventh grade, and we land them with all of the preparation for the bar and bat mitzvah. Some of the parents here have memories of, of that landing in their lap. And so we, we began, and we, we started in sixth grade with the Torah, and then uh, we felt that this was a right thing to do, so we started pushing a little further back and started with the fifth grade with the Haftarah, allowing them just a small taster uh, of what this will be like, but helping them go through the entire process of preparation. And remember, when it, with, when it comes to chanting from the Torah, it is not quite uh, as uh, simple as learning to read in a different language, which Hebrew is a different language and is written right to left and all of that. Yes, that part is, I'm not going to say easy, but that part happens a lot earlier. Uh, but then figuring out how to learn to read and then learn to chant, learn uh, these ancient musical notes that um, date back to about 7th century, um, let's see, so um, over 1,300 years ago. And, um, and then the Torah, because it is an ancient document written in pretty much the same way for over 2,000 years, doesn't contain the vowels or the chanting marks, so... You have first have to figure out how to do this, and then you have to figure out how to remember what you've learned, because when you look at the Torah scroll, you only have the Hebrew consonants, uh, and that's about it. So it's a it's a task and a challenge. Um, our students this year have been blowing me away with uh, with their commitment, and yes, everyone takes it at their own pace. This is, uh, as I remind uh, my students all the time, and I'm reminding all of you as well, this is not a performance. They are not at the opera. We do not judge their performance, or we do not judge it by how perfectly they, they hit this note or that note. Um, we do, I do expect them to pay special attention and make sure that Hebrew is actually Hebrew and not made up words because we treat Torah uh, with utmost respect. But the idea is they're doing this on behalf of us. This is the mitzvah that they're doing. It's not the mitzvah of performance. It's the mitzvah of reading from the Torah and the Haftarah on behalf of the gathered community. And so it's a, it's a big deal. I'm very, very excited about that. Um, and I am going to call up the students in groups, uh, each one for their aliyah. So first, if I can have Ginger, Nayala, and Shayna up here, and I'm going to invite their parents. This is the part that the parents may or may not have prepared for. I'm going to invite uh, their parents for the aliyah to do the blessing. Uh, all right, so... Um, my readers, my chanters, why don't you line up over here? Very good. And the parents, why don't you come over here? Um, we are starting. Moshe uh, El Okay, I'll help them. 
there we go. So we're starting over there. Ready? Yes. Baruch Hu et Adonai Hamorach. Baruch Adonai Hamorach Leolam Ba'ed. Baruch Adonai Hamorach Leolam Ba'ed. Baruch Ata Adonai Eloheinu Melech Haolam. Asher Bahar Banu Mikol Amim. Velatan Lanu et Torto. Baruch Ata Adonai Noten HaTorah. Amen. All right, you guys hold on to this. Uh, one of the parents, there we go. Uh, uh, I think this one, right? Ba'achotem ota b'makom kadosh ki chokha v'chokpanecha hi me'ishay Adonai ki chen tu ve'iti Okay. can come onto this side of the bima. Don't run away just yet. You're not completely <laughs> finished. All right, there we go. There we go. I'm coming up onto the other side of the bima. All right, so uh, my next uh, group of chanters are Max, Dahlia, Tyler, uh, Sadie, and Cole. Um, do I have everyone? There we go. OK. So my chanters up over here. Very good. And their parents coming up for an aliyah. What a lovely surprise, right? OK, very good. So if you're a parent coming up for an aliyah, come, come a little closer on this side. Um, ready? Baruch Hu et Adonai Hamborach. Baruch Adonai Hamborach Leolam Ba'ed. Amen. Hold on. Um, we were here. Um, all right. I was just just here. And we move the yard. Okay.
this is this is why this is not easy. Now hold on, Madua. That's the that's the next one. Okay. So right here. There. Uh, there we go. Excellent. See, that's that's how uh, that's how you know we've worked uh, hard and well on this. All right. Verse 16, if you're following. Okay. Beautiful. All right, you can step back. And Dahlia. Madua, lo haltem et hahatat bimkom ha kodesh ki kodesh kadashim hi veota natan lachem lasit et avon ha eda lecha per alehem. Okay, very good. So we close this, parents. Baruch Ata Adonai Eloheinu Melech Haolam Asher Natan Lanu Torat Emet Vechai Olam Natan Betocheinu Baruch Ata Adonai Notena Torah Amen. So you can hug your chanters. Uh, you like this? can go back and seat. Uh, the chanters can go back to their seats. The parents can come on to this side. All right. And for our third and last aliyah, we have uh, Hunter, Alicia, and Erica. And their parents coming up for an aliyah. Um, OK. Uh, you know what? We've moved on to the other side of, the, of this row, which makes it a little harder to see <laughs> and reach. There we go. OK. So parents, you can come closer. We promise not to bite. All right. Well, I can, can promise for them, but I promise about me. Baruch Adonai Hamborach. Baruch Adonai Hamborach Leolam Vaeth. Baruch Adonai Hamborach. Baruch Adonai Hamborach Leolam Vaeth. Baruch ata Adonai, Eloheinu melech haolam, asher bachar banu mikol ha'amim, v'natan lanu et orato, 
Baruch Ata Adonai, Noten Hatora. Amen. Someone please hold this. All right. This one's for you, and you are starting with Dabu. Very good. Dabu, Albane Israel, Lemur, Zot, Hachaya, Asher, Tochlu, Miko, Habehema, Asher, Oha, Oetz. Very good. Step down and. Oh, my freset parsa, vicious a hatches a parasol, my alad, kera, babema, ota to helu. Beautiful. Ah, et se lor to hu, me ma ale hageva, umi ma freset a parsa, et hagama. Kima ale gera hu Ufarsa and then nu ma freeze Tame hu la hem. All right, Shakoach and parents. Ruchata Adonai Eloheinu Melech Haulam Shemachamanu Torah Emet. Bechaye olam nata betochenu, Baruch ata Adonai no tena Torah. Amen. So you can give them a hug. I'll, I'll shake hands with everyone here. Shakur. You can all breathe out too. That was wonderful. I'm proud of you. Okay, and you can all actually return to your seats. Beautiful. Beautifully done. All right. Um, I never, uh, I never tire of uh, of inviting everyone to appreciate what an incredible thing just happened, um, and and how um, this ancient custom, this ancient tradition that we have, is. Um, very different. No one else really does it quite like this, and we have continued to cling on to our tradition for thousands of years. There are um, there are fragments, pretty large fragments of Torah scrolls that have been found in the Dead Sea Scroll Collection, which are over two thousand years old, uh, which pretty much look like the Torah that we use today. And uh, if you consider the kind of lives um, our people have lived over the last 2,000 years in different lands uh, and different circumstances, whatever we imagine those, uh, those parts of our story are, whether they're golden age or difficult times, and yet the Torah remains at the center of what we do. So uh, sharing this beautiful and, yes, challenging task with our, with our students uh, and with your kids is really truly special, and uh, all of them have been so amazing. I don't want to say too much because then the fifth graders are coming on. So uh, this will be this will be very special indeed. So page two hundred and fifty-three. While we have the Torah out, we continue our service with the words of Mishaberach, a prayer for healing. If you have any names that you would like to add to the prayer for healing, you may do so now. Um, Page 253 in the middle. Baruch atah Adonai rofea cholim, blessed are you Adonai who sends healing to those who are in need of healing. Mi sheberach avoteinu, mekor abracha leimoteinu. May the source of strength who blessed the ones before us Help us find the courage to make our lives a blessing and let us say Amen. Mi sheberach imoteinu 
מקור הברכה לאהבותינו, let's go in need of healing with רפואה שלמה, the renewal of body, the renewal of spirit, and let us say Amen. The next thing we do is called the Hagba, and that is when we elevate, we lift the Torah scroll. Would you please rise? I wanted to call on Jeff to, uh, to be our Hagba today. Pa bottom of page 252. Torah <laughs> לפני בני ישראל על פי אדוני ביד משה. All right. Um, let's just type a little bit. Mm -hmm. There we go. If you hold it and go have a seat, and if we can have our little ones, the ones who have not been chanting so far, come back and help us dress the Torah. And while we do that, you may all be seated. I'm going to call all of my fifth graders. <clears throat> I'm going to call all of my fifth graders up here uh, today. Come on up, come on up, guys. Line up over here behind me. Um, today, we, as I mentioned, is a special. Come, come over here. Come, come on up, come on up. All right. Uh, so today is a special um, Haftarah, um, so it doesn't follow the, the weekly cycle of readings, um, and the, it's a special selection from, uh, from the book of Ezekiel, because we are about to begin the Rosh Chodesh, the new month of Nisan, so uh, this Shabbat is known as Shabbat HaChodesh, and so a separate text, page 1002, so at the very back of the Chumash, if you want to follow with the words, and... Uh, our amazing fifth graders have been working. All right, so I have blessing before the half track. It would help, I think, if you guys sort of came a little closer together. Uh, I think it's over here. All right, there we go. Ready? Just step, step, step closer. Come on. All right, so uh, the blessing before the half track. Ready? Baruch Atah Adonai Eloheinu Melech HaOlam Asher Bachar Benevi'im Tobim Erasah Ledivrehem Hanemarim Be'emeh Start. That's right. Yes. Okay. Uh, you can hold the R to make yeah. it easier to trace. Akomar Adonai Elohim Barishon Behad Lahodesh Tikapar Ben Bakar Tamim Vehiteta Etamikdash. All right. Very good, Sasha. Beautiful. Okay. And Aidan. Vechen Tasa Beshiva Vahodesh Me Ishoge 
Bumi peti Fehi parten Et abayit Alright, Sam Rishon Arba Asar yom Lechodesh Yihye vachem Apasar Chav Shvot yamin Matzot yeah, hey. Beautiful. And you like. They are so on a sea Sorry, Finn. You see, this is when you know things went well, when the only mistake made was one by the rabbi. Uh, I think then we are in a really good place. Okay, so blessing after the haftarah. Uh, if you guys want to step up, I know you've just began to practice this, so so we can uh, we can call on on the rest of uh, of our community to step up with that as well. So ready. Adonai, Elohim, 
Actually, I want to invite all of you to rise, and I want to invite all of my fifth, sixth graders to come back out. All of the chanters, come on, everyone, onto the onto the bima. Let's uh, let's take a step onto the bima. Um, very good, everyone. And this is a, a really um, a truly exciting moment because we get to say what do we get to say at a moment like this? Piano is correct. All right, because you guys have really stepped up and uh, and brought all of us to this incredibly powerful moment. So we join together. Baruch Ata Adonai Eloheinu Melech Haolam Shehechianu Vehiemanu Vehigianu Lazman Hazeh. Blessed are you, Adonai, our God, Lord of the Universe, who have kept us alive and sustained us and kept our sanity, and I'm talking both about the students and about their parents, uh, and allowed us to figure out a way how to step up, how to learn a new skill, how to not be afraid, how to get a little louder, and we're working on that still, um, and how to really lead this community in such a powerful and meaningful way this Shabbat morning. May you continue to go from strength to strength, and let us say, Amen. Amen. Excellent. Now, page 256. Ye hallelujah, Shem Adonai, Kinis Gav, Shemo Levado. Do we have any more grandparents who would like to close the ark? Hodo al Eretz Veshamaim, Vayarem Kerem Leamo, Tehila Leko Asida. Live Israel, Anker of Hallelujah, Hallelujah. Kilaki Tov Nataki Lachem, Torati Alta Azobu, Ez Haim, Lama Kazikimba, Veto Mekeha Meusha, Derakeha. Darkei Noah, Vekom Nedivotea Shalom, Hashibeinu Adonai, Eleka Venashuha, Kadesh, Kadesh Yameinu, This is like a hundred percent attendance. I, I don't uh, I don't remember when was the last time that everybody was please got healthy and everyone could make it here. Amazing. Hello. All right, you can go back to your seats. Uh, well, it does, but it's not your seat. 
Um, okay. And just um, before, um, so the prayers, uh, as, I, as I mentioned, the prayer for Rosh Chodesh is on page 261. Page 261. Ihi ratzon milfanecha Adonai Eloheinu ve'elohe avoteinu ve'imoteinu shetechadesh aleinu et ha'chodesh haba letova ve'livracha. May it be your will, Adonai, our God and God of our ancestors, that you renew this coming month for us for the good and for blessing. V'titen lanu chaim arukim, may we be worthy of long lives, chaim shel shalom, lives filled with peace, chaim shel parnasa, lives filled with economic dignity, chaim shetehev vanu ahavat Torah ve'irat shemai, may our lives be filled with love of Torah and the fear of heaven, chaim shi mal'u mishal'ot libeinu letova. Uh, a life which, in which the longings of our hearts are fulfilled for good. Rosh Chodesh Nisan iye bayom shlishi. The new month of Nisan begins on Tuesday. May it come for us, for all uh, the Jewish people, and for all humanity, for peace and for blessing. Uh, and may hostages come home soon. Uh, page 283, would you please rise for Aleinu. Aleinu l'shabeach l'adon ha'kol l'atev g'dula l'yotzer b'reishi Sh'hu sam kalkeinu l'yached et shemo V'gohor aleinu l'amlik malkuto V'anachnu korim u'mishtachavim u'modim Lifnei melech malkei hamlachim hakadosh baruhu. 287. Uh, we turn now to page 294 as we close our service with the words of Kaddish. Um, this week we um, remember those whose yard sets occur this time of year. David A. Evans, Sherwin Fishman, Myrna Glassberg, Naomi Jacobson, Flora McCourt, Nan Milstein, Gerald Nacht, Edith Schultz, Charlotte Sherman, Miriam Stein, and Paul Wolfson. We also remember those who passed away in recent weeks and months. John Zonderman, Rick Spiewak, Andy Goldhammer, Marilyn Gluck, Richard Regan, Ralph Bleeks, Stephen Floman, Mark Cohen, Sheila Mushen, Yefim Krieger, Pablo Gonzalez, Robert Sussman, Estelle Spiewak, Ray Gelfand, Larissa Kaplunov, Cynthia Livingston, Jay Ginsburg, Douglas Montgomery, Louis Myers, Stuart Robert Klein, Tamara David, and Martin Lifshitz. Is there anyone else here observing a yard site? Zecher Tzadik Livracha, may the memory of righteous endure for a blessing, may comfort come to all the mourners as we say the words of Kaddish together. Yid Gadal ve'yid Kaddash me'i Raba, ve'almad yivrach reute ve'yamlich malchute, Bechaye Chon, Vyomei Chon, Vechaye de Chol Beit Israel, Vagalau Vizman Kari Vimru Amen. Yehe Shmer Abba, Mevarach Le Alamu Le Alme Al Maya, Yid Barach, Vish Tabach, Vid Paar, Vid Romam, Vid Nase, Vid Hadar, Vid Ale, Vid Halal Shme, the Good Sham Brehu, La Elam in Kolbir Hata, Veshirata, Tush Behata, Venechemata. Da Miran di Alma Vimru Amen. Yehe Shlamara Ba Min Shmaya, Vehaim Alenu Veal Kol Israel, Vimru Amen. O Se Shalom Bim Romav, Uya Se Shalom, Alenu Veal Kol Israel, Vimru Amen. May the one who creates harmony on high bring peace to us and to all Israel, and let us say Amen. Please be seated. Uh, <clears throat> All right, so we conclude our service with the words of Adon Olam, page 321. Adon Olam, Asher Malach, Beterem Kol, Yetzir Nivrach, 
May God bless you and keep you. May God's countenance shine upon you and be gracious to you. May the blessings of God always surround you. May God give you, all the children of Israel, and all the humankind, God's gift of peace this Shabbat and always. Let us say, Amen. So as the service ends, we are going to step outside um, and for Kiddush. Are we going to come outside? Would you want to tell us? In the second. Okay. Please take a seat just for another minute. Shabbat Shalom, everyone, and Mazel Tov. I want to invite everyone just to take a moment and take a deep breath. Okay. How are you feeling, guys? And I'm talking to fifth and sixth graders. How are you feeling, guys? Good? And parents? They really did. So what I want to invite all of us to do is to hold on to this feeling that we have now. Because in the years to come, there will be moments when we will be nervous, when we will be stressed. There will be moments when it will feel that the burden is too much, that there is too much work, that maybe I cannot do it. All of that will be there. But I want us to remember the way we feel right now. When you put the work in, and when you overcome your fears, this is the result. This is the way we all feel. And I am incredibly proud of all of our students today. They did a fantastic job. But I have a confession to make. The best part of all of it was the part of preparation that took place in this building where I witnessed multiple, multiple times when our students were helping each other and supporting one another and practicing together and working together. And that's the true spirit of a community that we have here. And yes, they are beautiful chanters. And yes, they did their job just fantastically well. It's a tool. It's a vehicle of being really proud of being Jewish and being part of a community that is a way to go forward where you know that people support you and stand by you and will jump in when you are about to make a mistake. And it's fine too. So that's the topic of our conversation today. We will be talking about community. Before we proceed with the program, there is a kiddush waiting for us just behind that wall. So we'll do the blessing for uh, grape juice, no wine there, just grape juice and challah. We'll take about 10 minutes break, bathroom, little mingle, and then we are meeting back together in here to continue with our program. <laughs> 